Christmas is around the corner, and if you're like me, you love those ornaments that go on the trees, and today we're gonna learn how to make Christmas ornaments with chemistry. And with me here is Jeffrey Vinicor, he's from That's UCLA. Right so what are we gonna do here? How are we gonna do this? We're gonna try to make Christmas ornaments with chemistry by using a process called plating. Okay. And that means we're gonna put a metal onto this surface, and it's using things like to make Canadian coins, to make chrome rims, jewelry, building materials. And today we're gonna to use a chemical process, usually use uh, electricity to do it, but we're gonna to try to silver this glass flask. And so- Just using this liquid in just here, we're using make two silver. liquids, okay. exactly. But we already have silver here, and the silver is already in this flask here. This clear liquid is the silver. So this is liquid silver. It's silver ion, so it's silver dissolved in water, and elements can have different forms. They can be charged, and then they can dissolve in water, like silver here and then we have to change it to its solid form to make the mirror. So to do that, we have here the secret ingredient. Okay. This is actually just sugar water, which I warmed up a little bit, and you're gonna help me with this experiment. We're gonna try to make two of these. Excellent. So, step one, we're putting on the safety goggles. I'm ready. And so in a second, we're gonna take off the yellow cap, and then quickly, we're gonna pour the sugar into the dissolved silver, and then we're gonna put on the cap and then we need to shake it. We need to shake it so that the liquid covers the entire flask. Sure thing, so what's gonna happen between the sugar water and the uh, liquid silver? There's right a now? reaction that's gonna happen. It's called a redox reaction, and basically, the silver right now has a positive charge, and when it goes neutral, it turns into silver metal, and we should see that by the formation of the metal mirror. Let's do it, I'm ready. Okay, okay. so uncap it. Okay. And then take the sugar water, ready? and on three, Okay. One, you gotta pour it fast, then cap it, and then really shake it. Okay, One, okay, okay. Two, I'm gonna watch you do it first so that I don't get Three, go, 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 okay, go. Okay, okay, pour, okay. Pour, 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 pour. Pour, cap pour, it. pour, pour. And now Sugar shake water. it. Okay, cap it. Shake, 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 okay. shake, shake. Check this out. That. Oh, look at that. You can do a couple dance moves with it. Okay. Shake it okay, around. Okay, ready? You can see it's slowly <laughs> changing. We got a little bit of a reflection here. It can take up to two minutes. Stick with me, Zaya. No problem, I'm, I'm working out my muscles right now Science anyway. Science can be a workout. It's slowly building up that silver surface. So what are we looking for? Is this gonna slowly sort of like cap the inside? Are we? Yeah, the reaction proceeds slowly and the silver is being deposited onto the glass. Oh, oh there we go. It started to happen. Can you see yourself? Yes, all of a sudden it's become mirrored and it's shiny. Let's and give it's... it like 10 more seconds. Okay. Keep going. Excellent. Five more seconds. Okay. All right. So we can put it just down on this little Look at this, look at this. this and we can actually zoom in and we can say hello to our camera operators. Oh, look at that. Hi, that guys. is absolutely wonderful. You can see them there wonderful. the reflection. We can see ourselves. And so this mirror is made of silver. We use the chemical process. And all metals reflect light, but they reflect light slightly differently. Uh -huh. For example, gold reflects more yellow light. That's why it's that color. Right. Copper reflects more red light. So silver, is nice to, for reflection of skin because it gives a light, uh, slight red tone. And so the expensive mirrors use silver, the cheaper ones use aluminum, which reflects more blue light. Absolutely beautiful stuff. This one's gonna be a bit heavy, but it's gonna go near the top of the tree. Thank you very much, Sure, Jeffrey of course. Vinicor. Thank you very much.